Good morning. Good. It's Friday. I didn't even realize that. How's everybody doing today? I'm still in my pajamas. <laughs> but today's the last day. Tomorrow I'll be in my um, my yoga pants because I'll start my exercise routine back tomorrow. But today I'm in my pajamas and I've been thinking. And I um, yesterday I, I did a live and I talked about how you should never let someone's opinion or silence silence you. And I want to take it a step further because I have a lot of friends. Hey, Cindy. I have a lot of friends who are entrepreneurs, whether it is in um, network marketing or whether it is on their own, like my friend Cindy here. She is her own entrepreneur. She has her own business. She started that business and um, she is the CEO of her life, as we all are the CEOs of our lives. And I say to a lot of people, because I do have women who want to join my team, and I have women who have joined my team, and the one fear they have is, and this is the truth, what are my friends going to think? What are my, um, what's my family going to say? What if people laugh at me? What if um, people think it's stupid? And and, and I think that's one thing that holds people back from really truly following their dreams. So let me, let me just pose this question to you. What would you do if someone came up to your child and said to your child, that's a stupid dream? I'm serious, put yourself, I want you to put your mom hat on. And I wanna know what you would do if someone came up to your kid and had the nerve to say to your kid, you're never going to make it to, you're never going to be a famous ballerina. You're never going to be an ice hockey player. That's stupid. Do something that makes sense in life. What if some person came up to your kid and told your kid that? How would you feel? What would you say? You would be livid. You would be absolutely infuriated. Would you not? So why do you accept that for yourself? Why do you accept that for yourself? You have a child inside yourself. We all do. That little kid in us never goes away. So why is it that we're willing to listen to that crap that people think they have the right to say to us if we wouldn't accept it for our children, for our innocent children who have dreams and, and um, big, huge dreams and desires? You shouldn't. And none of us should. And... I don't understand it because I would never tell somebody that. I would never. Who am I to tell somebody that they are not deserving to follow their dreams? Who is anybody to do that? Nobody has that right. This is when someone doesn't know how to stay in their own lane. This is when someone isn't satisfied and happy in their lives that they've got to go bring another person down. So if it's not okay for your kid, it's not okay for you. And what I mean when I say, because listen, I have been, um, I've been an entrepreneur with Lime Life for almost three years. And I have a lot of my family and friends who back me up and support me. And I also have a lot of family and friends who don't. Well, I can't dwell on them. I can't help it if they don't get it. I get it. That's all that matters. All that matters is that you believe in yourself you get it and you know that it's a good thing for you and your family and you have to put your blinders on and stay in your lane and forget these other people and their opinions just let it go over your head I always tell my team to wear your coat of armor I actually haven't said that in a while and when when someone says something like that to you just let it ping off of your armor ping 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 ping, ping. forget it because their opinion of you and their silence doesn't change your path unless you let it. So don't let it change your path. If you wanna be a, a Lime Life Beauty Guide or you want to start your own entrepreneurial business or if, if whatever that dream may be, it's yours and it's not theirs to take from you. So when someone is silent, 
and doesn't encourage you and uplift you, girlfriend, that ain't your circle of friends. Don't allow that silence to silence you and de to derail you from something you know could be good for you and your family. Have a happy Friday.